So look who it is. Wilson is here. You know, I, now we can all now we can all leave after this. This is really why we're here. <laughs> At least someone said it. That's, I'm saying it. I say that all the time. And are they not? Are they not a true days power couple? Come on, when they become a power couple. Oh yeah, absolutely. Power couple, super couple. We're 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 all of it. <laughs> yeah. They're actually, they're actually, uh, they released the dual app just as a precursor to announce that the show is now going to be not Days of Our Lives, Wilson. <laughs> it's for spinoff. Wilson, yeah. of Wilson of Our Lives. Wilson of Our Lives. Wilson of Our Lives is coming up. We should actually do that on the dual app. Wilson of Our Lives. Wilson of Our Lives. Wilson yeah. Of our lives. You can see the stuff you don't see we on the show. Should put the the dressing room sessions on. on I wanted on to talk room. to you about that. Your dressing room sessions need to go on the app. Yes. So we have to have a meeting about that. Okay. All That's right. coming up. Well, now, now we just got to negotiate my salary. Your salary for <laughs> <laughs> the rights to you'll, use the lampshade over you'll, your you'll head. Lose, <laughs> you'll lose around. 25%. You have a lampshade over your head. Yes. I did. Yeah. Okay. Would you like to see that on the dual app? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Lampshades. I, I I started a trend. I just saw someone uh, the other day with a lampshade on their head. I'm like, that's from. Yeah. That's good. Have you watched Chandler's yeah. stuff on the Dual app? You have to see some of it. It's pretty funny. I'm hearing about the Sammy audition. Sammy audition's really pretty out. good. And yeah. then his candid cast answers are very intriguingly interesting. I'm going to spend some time tonight. Yes, I think you. And I'm going to watch more of Chandler Massey. <laughs> Even more, than even you more, because well, I'm gonna, see. I'm gonna miss him after being here with her all day. I'm gonna go home. And at Mathis Brothers. <laughs> and at Mathis Brothers. Yeah. And a whole week of work. We've been doing a lot of good work yeah, yeah. lately. Yeah. Get ready for another week. Uh, ne oh next week God, as well. Next week there's more. Okay. So what did you think, Freddie, when Chandler did these amazing scenes? He gets his memory. Will gets his memory back, and those scenes played out in the beats that they played out. And then you guys, Sunny and Will, reconnected. Those were classic great soap moments. He hit it out of the park. You were amazing. Yeah, I love it, that so it was. Much. It was. It was a. Uh, so much. There, there <laughs> like was, I could watch it again. Right now. It was. It was built Such up. I mean, the the over arc of, of of Wilson. I mean, from being best friends for Will coming out to getting together to him dying to him coming back to life, getting his memory back has just been a roller coaster and it was just beautiful to watch. It was it was very, very exciting. Yeah. And it was just, it's really great to sit back and watch those scenes because as an actor, you can't really enjoy it while you're doing it because you're in the moment. So it's really nice, it, you knew because it was emotional that it was awesome. But I love watching back and being, you know, having nothing to do with it anymore and just watch it as an audience member and it was like amazing. Yeah. And you? So you're going through it. I hated hated those. You <laughs> loved that. He loved those things. I know. He told me so before. Um, yeah. It, I mean, it was. There's so many layers to it, and and just being able to get to have those mem have that storyline, and have those scenes with Freddie because of all the history that we've we've been through. Our characters have been through. Um, I mean, it was just you know like ideal situation you know as, as an actor there's so many things that you can play uh, and uh, Freddie was just so incredibly like present for all of it that it would just it just I feel like it just worked you know we just sort of did it but and, what were you had did you have some nerves going into it like I've got to make yeah. this I mean I would think the buildup of that of playing the amnesia it's a big payoff for the audience when you have that kind of scene as an actor on a soap opera where there's so much are you not like oh my god i hope i can absolutely How does that go down? i i i read it when, when i got the scripts i thought to myself i gotta get this i gotta do this right like this is it this has been such a long process of will trying to piece together these fragments um of who he is and then they all come you know, crashing together at once in this emotional climax, and I, I definitely was. I mean, when when I read the scene, the, the the scripts, I was nervous. I was maybe a little, like a, a little over a week out. Um, but when I when I prepped and when I did it, you know, when I was there on set, I felt the energy, and I knew that it was. I wasn't nervous anymore. I was just once you were in it, excited. Were in it. To, yeah. 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 And you and what we talked about on the Jewel app, which you can find this video, is we talked about just playing that love. How Sonny's uh, so there with Will, he just loves him. He just loves him, and oh, yeah. he just so pre you just well, watch your. Well, that's a whole other thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that that's that, and and the people uh, they they respond to the true love. You know, it's it's so interesting because Chandler and I will just be like kicking it like we are now, and then there's just like 
The like flips? we we literally I feel we hop into Go character, into the character. Yeah. without thinking. No. Like yeah. there's even moments that he's like like telling jokes as they're counting down. Like like we'll be like doing. Not bits. him. I'm and shocked. Then, like, I'm so surprised. You're like quiet on the set. And we're like okay. And then we go from like this energy to looking at each other and like instant connection. And uh, uh, yeah, but the, the love is just, it's just, it's just there. And it's just, it's. That's a great point. Our transition from <laughs> bros to like, <laughs> yeah. to lovers is like, well, we've got that. Like you go, yeah. boom, boom. Yeah. You boom. actually feel it happen. Yeah. There's something in, but without like, it's not like, all right, come on, we're going to be like in character now. Like yeah. we literally are just like, <laughs> and then like, Wait, uh, and then you're like, oh my god, well, yeah, yeah. yeah we'll it's just the history we'll there, me now. <laughs> and uh, and we do something similar. I feel like I don't want to, I don't speak for Chandler on his process, but I feel like with uh, like we just kind of we're always like he's always surprising me because I think we make choices, but we don't make choices. Like I, we just kind of consume what, at least I do. I, and you, I feel like you're the same way. We consume it, and then whatever is in that moment, we allow the other person to affect us throughout the whole thing. Like, he shapes my scene. It's and, not my choices, it's your choices. And vice versa, scene. the scenes that we did this past week, remember? Uh, that you where, taped this past that week. That we, we taped this past that you'll week. you'll see seven years from now. Yeah. Um, <laughs> where you just, uh, for, even from rehearsal to tape, it was a, you, you, like, the, the choices you made on that, like those long, the, basically those two like long speeches. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That you, you came out with, you, you, you brought something to it that I had no idea, I, I did not expect at all. So it completely changed the dynamic of the scene. And it was great because like, I love when when that happens, when when the scene goes off the rails of maybe like, oh, I think it's maybe gonna go like this. But when it when it takes a left turn, yeah. it's usually for the Great better. Yeah. yeah. Christopher Sean is wrapping his run on air, I believe in the next Good week, 10 days. <laughs> We're gonna send no, I'm, I'm, I'm still crying myself to sleep, honestly. Gosh, I, I, maybe he'll come back one day. Maybe he'll come back. Yeah. So the the scenes that we'll see play out, because it basically, I, I, you know, what happens as he exits the show. How did you feel about how they wrote him out? Um, Paul. They wrote up Paul. Just the way he handled what comes to him, mm -hmm. it, it just was true to his character. Mm -hmm. He's just so selfless. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Poor Paul. Poor Paul. Oh, we did that last. Yeah. We had poor Paul. Yeah, but for real, like, man, this, he, 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 you know, it's he's just like Christopher. Like, he's got this, like, river of integrity and, like, compassion running through his character. Uh, and that never, like, he never wavers on that. And, and he sort of leaves, he never compromises in his, his integrity. It's great. It's actually, you know, I mean, it's a feat of strength. Yeah, right, right. So, have you guys stayed in touch with him at all, or...? Yeah, it's, uh, I mean, that's the, the beautiful thing about social now is I'm just like, I follow him on Instagram and so I get to see all I always doing and we interact and uh, uh, so it's just really great just to see that, you know, all your friends and what they're doing and I'm glad he's doing well. Uh, I played Fortnite, I play Fortnite sometimes with his son, so, <laughs> with his 12 year old son. Interesting. He's way better. Way than, better than you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, uh, and I, and I'll, I'll I'll talk to him. I'll also play games with him sometimes. It's hard because he lives in Glendale. I, I live down by the airport, so it's like long distance relationships are hard. Are hard, know? yes, they are. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I selfishly I was I, I like selfishly miss him on set just because we we would spend so much time together, you know. So as they wrap me up, what is your favorite Wilson moment of all time? Um, give me one, two, three. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, no, I'm not gonna steal yours. I know, I know what one of yours is, but and, and this might be what like, a, this might be a cheap shot uh, because it just happened. But the fact that that when he got his memory back was so pivotal. There was something of that the love was there, and it was like years to get to that moment where like they're back. Because when he came back from the dead, he didn't remember. So it was like that moment that he remembered, and we had that scene in Doug's place was unbelievably a just a great scene. And of course the wedding, and then um, what I think he's gonna say. What are you gonna say, Chandler? Yeah, what are your favorite uh, top Wilson moments? Of the it? the New Year's resolution uh, box that that yep. scene at the end of the day that just had some sort of like magic to it that was completely unexpected, um, and it just felt so real and conversational, but also deep with the relationship. You know what also was a favorite moment of mine was. Um, 
the Halloween, uh, I mean, the episode on Halloween where we had those glasses and like the cape and we, we, we had that silly string fight. Remember that? Yeah. And we sort of just like went at each other and, like, or, or, or was hitting each other with silly string and a, a silly string and ended up in each other's arms and I remember, just like yeah, such a... That was, you know what I thought you were going with that was the face painting that was more recent. Oh yeah, that was fun too. And then we had yeah. a serious conversation yeah. while we had face So paint. silly string and face paint are your favorite things. Yeah. Uh, oh, I, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, because, you know, it, it's, it introduces it's another element. Le, yeah, element to it rather than just like you're, you're in a room, you know, talking about whatever. Yeah. It was great. Cool. Yeah. All right. To see more of Freddie and Chandler, watch Days of Our Lives weekdays on NBC. Watch more fun content with them on the new Dual app, which is so much fun. And happy 53rd anniversary, Days of Our Lives. Hashtag Wilson.